can't get all three of us on the screen at the same time. Nah, when you because it's Zoom, like when you start talking, it'll show you on the screen. Uh, oh no no no! You can do it in um. Oh, yeah, you when you look How up you that, that view, when you go to view instead of speaker, put it on gallery. So top right hand corner, you should see view, and it looks like nine dots. Yeah, I just did that. In the and then go to gallery. Oh, there we go. Okay, look, yeah, look at that. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. That's why you got to have a black woman on. Black ah, woman. You know what I'm saying? Because <laughs> I'm like, I don't know what's going. <laughs> I don't be using Zoom like that. Oh, but anyway. Yeah. Yeah. But anyway, I mean, I probably should keep all this in, but. <laughs> but. Of us learning. Yeah. <laughs>
Uh, I'm Ron from YouDon'tReadComics.com. I'm a comic book journalist. Uh, I review comics every Wednesday. I have a wonderful staff that helps me review books. Um, I'm also on Instagram and Facebook and all the other sites making memes. I need to start doing more reels and TikToks like my friends over here. Yes, you do. <laughs> <laughs> but for now, that, that, that's it. If you um, want, it, want any recommendations, want to know what to read, want to know what's bad, what's good, uh, look me up at YouDon'tReadComics.com. And we teaching this boy, we, we teaching him how to talk into the mic. <laughs> yeah, speaking to the mic, baby. You know, it's crazy. I forgot that. You know like... what it is? To stop me. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Your sound, your, 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 your sound went out. Oh, my bad. No, yeah, it's now. back. Yeah, I hear you now. Yeah, yeah, I said, you know what stopped me from talking into the mic? Toxic masculine. Remember that joke when you was a kid, like talking to the mic? Yeah, that's, yeah. that's the joke we've been making to you. <laughs> what are you talking yeah, about? Nah, that's the like, joke like, we've been saying. Joke. So it's like I avoid talking into the mic. It's just like, like I said, toxic masculinity. That I it is. <laughs> we made, made that joke last night to you. Yeah, I we said, did. We did. I said Mike will you, teach you. You are you. You are you. I just didn't think it was like that joke. You know. No, that was the exact joke we were saying. I was okay. we were like speaking to the mic, baby. We yeah. know you never. I feel like I started it with I know you've never done it. That's why you're not as good. Check, check the podcast. Uh, I I said something I wild like that. Yet. We recorded yeah, it. you gonna listen? You gonna be like, this is these some wild people, yo. These, these my boys. But come on with the come on with the toxic man. So speaking into a mic is gay now. Like, come on. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yo, I saw somewhere them. I saw women say that eating dessert was gay or ordering an appetizer. Oh yeah, that's toxic. Yeah, tragic. Y'all yes. can't even enjoy yeah, food. Nah, I'm, I'm a early dessert. You know what I mean. Real quick, real quick side note. Um, there's an influencer who uh, men are trying to cancel because he did a skit on like how men try to get girls drunk and play it off as like we're having fun, right? Take another shot. Da, 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 da. And men got so upset. I'm going to send exposed. it to you guys because they were exposed. And it was like, that happens all the time where guys are like, oh, don't you want another shot? Take this shot. Oh, you a lightweight da, 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 to get you lit so they could fuck. It was insane. But yes, today's about Moonlight. We're going to talk Moonlight. about Moonlight. 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 Moonlight light. Wow. Yeah, yeah. The shirt, the shirt. Shirt coming, you know? But yeah, so uh, in case you guys... Yes. Oh yeah. Make sure to make sure to cop. Make sure to cop that shirt. You know. Again, support your uh, content creators. Link will be in the description below. I uh, also, uh, even though I think I'm gonna try to do this, even though we're not like officially live, I'm gonna try to do this in a YouTube premiere type of way where you guys can still like leave live comments, comments while we're going, even though we can't actually read it. Mm -hmm. But I'll still try to be in the chat later when I when I post the video later to, to today. So we can respond to your live comments, even though we can't respond in this video. But uh, yeah, so we're going to be talking spoilers for episode three of Moonlight. Moon, now I'm saying Moonlight. Now yeah, now I'm Moonlight. doing it. Moonlight night. night. Episode three, stars and the moon. So um, yeah, Frankie, what did you, since, since you were the one that like, you weren't that big of a fan of episode one, you did I, like I, you did like episode two, but yeah, I want to I want to start with you because of that. What'd you think of episode three? It was all right. Um, <laughs> I just feel like I, I don't hate it. Um, of all the shows, these this is the lowest stakes to me. Like I never I'm never excited to the point where I'm like nervous. Um, you know, even and, and it's not because it's like saying like Loki and you know. WandaVision had huge stakes. It's not that because Falcon and the Winter Soldier and Hawkeye were ground level shows and I still had excitement and things like that. And by episode three, I, I'm not as excited. Like, and I was thinking about the mummy because Layla looks just like Rachel Weiss in this. Like, and I think that's a, a, a choice, right? That they're making, like the way they're styling her and stuff. Um, and even in the mummy, I was on the edge of my seat. I was trying to find out what was going on with Imhotep or whatever his name was, I forgot. Um, and here it's like, I'm watching a scene with nine gods. And I was like, I was just more, I was more impressed with Kevin, not Kevin Bacon, uh, it's racist. Uh, Ethan Hawke. <laughs> Ethan Hawke. Ethan Hawke, um, finessing the gods. I was gonna say, you think this has higher stakes, uh, lower stakes than like Hawkeye? Hawkeye, like, what was he protecting the neighborhood? That's what I'm, that's that's right, what I'm right, saying. Hawkeye is all, like heavily intertwined with the MCU. You don't think that's well, a thing? Well, no, so that's what I'm saying. It's not that it's 
Hawkeye was ground level, right? But I was nervous for Hawkeye at one point. Is he going to jail? Is somebody going to die? Like, I I felt attached enough to the characters in the story where I was nervous. Um, and the same with Falcon and the Winter Soldier, right? That, same thing. You've seen these characters before, though. Right. But it's not even that because, I mean, I guess Loki's the same way. But I've seen shows where I am invested and I don't know, they're not from the MCU. You get what I'm saying by episode three. And it's not because they're not acting well, like Oscar Isaac is doing such a good job, but I I don't know. It's like Eternals. You know how Eternals is like, they didn't seem that strong, even though you knew they were that strong. It's the same thing. I'm like, they're talking about um, destroying the world and I'm not, nervous for the world at all at all are y'all all right y'all think, y'all Natalie, think- like, i'm definitely not nervous for the world no i'm not nervous for the world I know yeah about the, the greater scheme grand scheme of the mcu like oh, 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 i was oh, i was watching it <laughs> i was watching infinity war on the airplane I forgot how good that. Honestly, I think it was better than Endgame, and I it forgot. I oh, know, yeah, Infinity War is definitely better than Endgame. Yeah. I totally because I I've only seen it like twice. Is you know they were, yeah, but that that whole time we shook. I'm like, oh my god, every every scene, it's fear, it's what's about to happen, you know. And there are multiple characters who could beat that um, Thanos at that point you get what i'm saying and they still built it in a way that we were terrified the entire movie and i just want to see more of that but all in all it was i it was mid all right well, ron. It <laughs> ron since you're making, face, you're making faces <laughs> I, mean, I like the story though like i think that it was dope that we got to see more of uh mark specter in this one it was definitely a mark heavy episode and then it's like they were hiding mark from us they also teased that there was a um a third personality that we haven't yeah. seen yet, which I was definitely looking forward to. Um, and we got a lot of action. Like people were saying, there wasn't a lot of action in the other episodes, and we got a lot of action in this one. I wish we had it. I'm, gonna- <laughs> I'm sorry, Excuse- cut this out. Let me say it. Let me say it. You get you get one you get you get one you get one you get one. I agree. Like that the the scenes on the rooftop, like uh, that that should have been more like the Aladdin video game. Remember the Aladdin video game? (laughs) Oh no, that game that game was hard on Genesis. That game was hard. I ain't never played a game that hard in my life. It should have been real like that. But I think I don't know if it's Oscar Isaac or whatever. But like the fight scenes, like Frankie said, were kind of slow. But and when he transformed into Moon Knight, the the action was rocking. So. But remember, that's also not him, and it's also it's a combination so of C- yeah, CGI, CGI. Yeah, it's not double probably. Yeah, yeah. So. But like, but like, I get what Frankie's saying, but like, I feel like out of all the MCU shows, this one is more character driven than it is superhero driven. Like, there's not even even four or three episodes in, mm-hmm. we haven't really seen much Moon Knight in a Moon Knight show. Yeah. We didn't see Scarlet Witch till episode four. Yeah, I'm but it was sorry. Still, we didn't see still. Wanda like it was character driven. It was all about Wanda and her relationship with Vision until like episode four and five, and we still was dreading like they were doing regular I Love Lucy episodes, and we were like, but the thing is, we, yeah, we but that's saw a little Wanda and all the Avengers movies and stuff like that, and we never got to see her character, so we wanted to see her character. You know what I mean? Not even, but not even, but not even just, us. but not even just that, but like. Even though Wanda wasn't like shooting energy beams or something like that, after it was still like the intrigue of the world, like the world was still magical. It was still magical superhero circumstances within those episodes because it wasn't reality. It was she was still in an alternate reality. Whereas, but, this- but my point is, the, what you're saying could have been done with Mark in a way without them actually showing it. There's so much, and they had three times the amount of time because these episodes are an hour. WandaVision was like 20 minutes. Mm-hmm. And there, I didn't really, okay, not that I didn't realize, but they didn't show us that Mark was invincible until this episode. Yeah, yeah. They didn't show us anything and they didn't have to show us it like outright, but even with like Steven waking up and not knowing what happened, there was no clues as to anything like mystical happened. So that mystery, that mystical part could have still been woven in without it like outright saying what Moonlight is in the way that WandaVision was, right? WandaVision didn't have her really doing magic. It was like 
something was always a little off, right? She walked outside, the helicopter was red. She, you know, it was stuff like that. In the black and white world, something was in color. So, so small stuff like that, that made us like, what's going on here? There was never a time that I was truly like, what's going on? I was just sitting there like, this guy's crazy. I see what you're saying. And then like, we didn't get to see Kanji do any magic until this episode. And he, and he, did, was- like, he did like a big thing, but I still wasn't like, What's the rest of the world doing? The Avengers are not seeing this. Like in my head, I was thinking that. Like I, I like Kanchu. I like Kanchu. He's like Ryuk mm-hmm. um, from Death Note. From Death Note. From Death yeah, Death. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. But no, I like I like Kanchu too, and I wish we did get to see more of him, especially after what happened. And was it? It was this episode, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> after like him basically getting uh, locked, locked away. Yeah, and I was like, we only had episode three and they already getting rid of Khonshu and we only got six episodes in the season. And I think that's, it constantly is a point of, Moon, not even just a Moon Knight, but like these MCU shows were like, it gets hampered by only having six episodes. Yeah. Where maybe like with, with, with Frankie's issues, those could have been addressed if we had more episodes to play with. But it's like... Yeah, pretty much like you said, they, they locked up Khonshu, which is essentially taking Moon Knight away from the show. But we haven't haven't even gotten that much Moon Knight. No, but you to take them away, it's just like what what are, what are we doing? And I, and that's what I was saying. Like, so I could see some people not really enjoying the show from that aspect, in the sense of like we haven't really gotten much Moon Knight in the Moon Knight show. But for me, like I do like the character mo- stuff that we're that we're building with like a lot of the the dynamic between Mark and Steven, and then who this third personality, which you know more than likely is going to be Jake because that's who it is in the comics. So, but you know, obviously the MCU does its own thing. So who knows? It could be Mephisto. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like the, it could be that, Rob that, Boner. Yeah. The fact that he was invincible, like Frankie said, like I didn't I didn't know where they were going with that. And then the comic book fan in me wants to know, is he invincible because they're going by phases of the moon? Like what kind of moon are they are they going? What are they, what are they doing? Who knows? <laughs> and they took him away. And, and you know, that's like, his before. thing. And I mean, I'm guessing, like we we're not gonna get Moon Knight back and probably going into like you know maybe episode, episode five, five, six. six. Yeah, when it's re- rounding out, like so. There's only six episodes, or there's eight? only there's only six. No, there's only six episodes. You sure, six. There's yeah. six episodes. Yes, and and plus that's his whole thing: fighting evil by the moonlight, and he yeah. gives. Full moon, he gets his power. Like, exactly. yo, really one of the Stephen Grant show, and we get, we get, we got some Mark Specter. It's really just Stephen Grant. I do have to say, him jumping in the air and doing the crescent moon with his cape is one of the best shots I think in Marvel yeah. history. Shots, yeah, yeah, like awesome. actual free trade shots. I was nah, like, whoo, not not Marvel history. I don't think freeze frame shots, not scenes. Yeah. A freeze, name me a freeze frame well, that shot. Image is like dope. It's gonna be a freeze like, frame. Some the Avengers, no, no number uh, one, Avengers all jumping. The first Avengers where they the panor, and that's even not even a freeze frame. So I'll say the Age of Ultron jumping Avengers. I was I was thinking freeze frame shot in uh Marvel's What If where Hawkeye was you talking about a cartoon? Come on, yeah, but you said Marvel, and I'm like, come on, okay, that's, okay, that's the best, right. that's the best freeze frame shot, and what okay. if. Okay, you know what? You're right. The animation was incredible. I'll give you that. But I didn't say yeah. I said one of. I didn't say the best, but I think it's one of the best. Um, I do think. Uh, I don't know. I'll give this Moon Knight shot over that Hawkeye shot, even though that Hawkeye shot is a close second. Ron, what would you say? The best shot. I, I always go with Thor in Infinity War, but I don't know if you can count that as a shot. Like when he just went is that a hand. F- Talking about that, yeah, that's not really a freeze. That's frame. a that that's a. a I'm talking about something that a scene that someone yeah, that's like framed. yeah. That's... Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I ain't got one. We think of we think of shots like iconic shots would be like the first Avengers movie where they do that spiral. They're yeah, all they do the spiral the and yeah, just yeah. yeah, just then I'm like, would you take us? Would you freeze frame that? Right or like. Uh, Captain America holding the helicopter with his bare hands. That that's a freeze frame. Nah, though. nah. If he was shirtless, it'd be a freeze frame. But oh, <laughs> sex- oh yeah. to- that's toxic masculinity <laughs> at its finest. Honestly, is it though? Even Chris Evans was like, "You sure you don't want me to be shirtless during this scene? Like, you don't know your, you don't know the, you don't know the audience. You don't know, like, right, 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 right. They don't. They don't though. They don't. That's he should have been. They'd be like, "Why would you be shirtless? Like, but why would he have been?" Sh- 
Figure out a reason. Figure out a reason. Maybe his shirt got ripped and he was like pulling it off. I don't. Bucky slashed him. He was like, and he's trying to hold that helicopter. Like, you don't need a. They didn't need a. They didn't need a reason for that sex scene in uh in Eternals. In Eternals. How else we gonna know they in love unless he let her hit? Yeah. They threw. They just threw that shit in there. So you knew it was high stakes because they had sex I also once. Like Iron Man. See, I know people don't like Iron Man three, but the scene with the airplane where he saves everybody, I love that too. I don't remember. Yeah, I don't even remember. <laughs> Dang, you talking about Dang, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, So I'm like, it's not that memorable. But yeah, that yeah. that 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 Moon Knight fight was was incredible. And I wish we did get to see more of that before they took Khonshu away. Mm-hmm. Agreed, agreed. I did love that scene too when um he and Steven was redoing the constellations, like reversing time. Yeah. And it was turning. Is that, look, that was weird too. Were they reversing time or just reversing the movement of the stars? Reversing, reversing the rotation. movement. They were reversing the movement of the stars. Yeah. Oh, okay. Either, but that's Everybody what I'm saying. Nothing they just described. Yeah. So time didn't reverse, but but right. I'm like, wouldn't that mess up? Because like that okay. was happening. The oceans and everything. yeah, the, the ocean. Tides. Yeah. yeah. The temperature be be going up and down, kind of like really quick, mad fast, like it, yeah. And the whole world, and and they showed like the whole world saw it. That's why Conshu yeah. got banished. Yeah, I like, want to see a show that's just regular people at the office during the MCU. That. Tried that. I'm powerless. <laughs> they had terrible writing writers, yeah. but like also they didn't have any of the good properties mm-hmm. for that show for powerless. But like imagine. Somebody in their office with a coffee, they're like, what's going on in the sky right now? Or like they're swimming and they drown because Mark Spector is fucking around like in the back. Like, I don't know. I see I, like I, nah, I want to see like a hood version of <laughs> like yo, like you like, you like you see this shit? Like <laughs> yeah, yeah. uh so you just finish your car payment and uh the whole throws it at a Centauri. Yeah. You tight. You sick, yeah. You, you writing letters to Tony Stark. He not, he not writing back. He not writing back. <laughs> it becomes like another Stan episode. Dear Stan, I wrote Yo, you, but facts. you still ain't call me. Yeah. Facts. I'm about to pay, my, pay my car. Like, this is my last car payment. Yeah. <laughs> you got the money. But like, but also uh, with that, like, real, real quick, shout out to, uh, not a shout out, but like, I wanted to reference or uh, say rest in peace to Gaspar. Uh, I can't think, what's, what's his Gilbert. last name? Uh, yeah, Gil, uh what, let me look up his name. Uh, Is that uh, yeah, Gas, Gaspar? Gas, Gaspar Il, Il, Iliel, the guy that died. Uh, oh, Gilbert after, Gottfried? No, no, no. The guy, the uh, the guy yeah, that was in the in the scene with uh, the he was. T- oh yeah, 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 yeah. I see, yeah, I know the, the guy. Yeah. I thought you were talking about Iago. Okay. I know. Well, yeah, him too. But like, but no, for I can't fucking I can't fucking talk. Specifically for Moon Knight, yeah, the guy that had the like the connection with his wife, mm-hmm. yeah, he died after filming during a ski accident. He was supposed to end up playing the Midnight Man for like further seasons, but yeah. wow. this is the first That's time, nice. yeah. So yeah, he died for a ski accident. So this is the first episode that we see him. We're not sure we're gonna see him in more episodes, but yeah, rest in peace to uh to him. But uh yeah, what what was I gonna say? So uh, for this episode, like we got to see like, and I, and I and I do kind of agree with that. Like, what Frankie was like, yeah, we got to see the whole pantheon of gods, and I was like, oh, I wasn't even that, I wasn't that excited. Yeah, underwhelmed. It wasn't like uh, you know how hype hype you was to see the uh the council and um Loki, like the the Beyonders or whatever, whatever they were being called. Or even just a tease of the Illuminati and the, 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 the just Doctor Strange trailer. You a a like, shine of a bald head had yeah. us piss our yeah. pants. Are you yeah. kidding me? And I mean, but some of that is recognition, right? We can't, people don't know the gods like that, but yo, even seeing the- Even just how we see Kanchu, if they had just showed all the gods like that real quick, you know? Yeah, like their true form. Like JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, like their stands, you know what I mean? Like if their avatar was standing there and they were standing behind them. Yeah, behind them. That would have been, yeah. That, that would have been, been fire. That would have been better. Cause like, who was it? Like Osiris, like they're big names in Greek mythology, like Osiris, Horus. The the god from Black Panther was yeah, the, African the, chick. Yeah. What, the, B- well, no, I don't think it was Boss. No. But I thought I th- that was her the, name. But the chick that was talking to um uh Mark Spector, that was like, have you ever been through this before, yada yada. That's boss, her avatar or her god, the god that she's in possession of. That's uh boss sister. 
Ah, uh, okay, okay, okay. The African chick you're talking I about. I can't think of her name. What 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 is the name? I I wrote uh, I got it. I had it up here. But no, yeah, I don't have it. No, that you was you thought you was ready. Sex, sex, <laughs> sex, segment, segment. Yeah, that's boss Sex-Man. sister. Okay. But like, you don't even reference. Like, can we get a reference? Like, they should reference. Yeah. I shouldn't have to the Google only, that. The only I should have. Yeah. This episode it was like, oh, remember, remember Madripoor, which is pretty much like uh, Budapest at this point. But yeah, I shouldn't have to Google that. Oh, this is a Black Panther connection. Like, they should. You should say something. Like, yeah. especially since there's so much talking in this show Mm -hmm. so why do i still need to reference things if y'all talking the whole show the show is 80 percent exposition so i'm like and even when we get mark is moon knight it seems like he doesn't talk when he's moon knight either like we don't get no he doesn't no when he's moon knight no he doesn't talk he doesn't talk yeah but i mean he throwing hands you talk when you fight steven talks yeah he's a child and he's not really fighting he's saying shit like time out please yeah <laughs> please don't hurt me but you know you punching somebody you got time to talk you're breathing out Can't yeah. but um so let me ask y'all like because because i'm thinking like because I, I like it's not that the show was boring or anything like that it's just right. yeah i enjoyed it you know? yeah i enjoy it, and i enjoy the the character but it's just not as much as many superheroics <laughs> Or whatever going on. I don't know if they just really want to. I don't know if it's that. Personalities or they want to I don't think it's that, y'all. Because I, I was watching Legion. Legion don't got no X Men in it until the second season. You get what I'm saying? I mean, yeah. I mean the villain, but I'm just saying, like, they're it's it, it's coming off the same footing as Moon Knight, where like most of the characters we didn't know and stuff like like they're not as widely talked about, and I still was gripped. And there was no magic, or there, you know, you didn't see any powers until you realized that you've been watching powers the whole time. You get what I'm saying? So like the whole time you think he's just a little wild, and then you realize he's been like manipulating reality this entire time. But it's I don't know, something's off about it. I can't put my finger on it, but everyone I speak to too are like, mm. I never, I only people in my comments because I think they just don't like when I say things. Be like, you're wrong. This is the <laughs> best thing ever. But when I talk to people one on one, they're like, yeah, it's I. Right. I never see someone enthused about it. Honestly, I don't really hear too many people like I don't really see like in the Twitter space like people. But the same uh, thing happened with Hulk. I, like I, people weren't talking about it, and I love Hulk guy. You know what I mean? Yeah, but if I say anything, I'd be like, yo, it's sunny out they'd be like actually it's a 10 percent chance of rain yeah. <laughs> that dumbass I'm like, yeah. yeah i'm going i'm going i'm going through that right now people still yeah. hit, hit me up on the storm video i, I about, get the disagreeing in the comments when they start cursing it's like come on are you really gonna see what? me people don't yeah. know how people don't know how to art like we were talking about this the other yesterday like people take it personally when you disagree like if if if, if for example you say to me i don't like buffy the vampire say so i'm like fuck you you wrong but i'm not gonna be like your mama's a hoe and all. I mean, yeah, I'm a, exactly. I mean, I might say well, that. that I, mean, I might reserved, say that. To friends, that energy but. is only reserved for the internet. You know what I mean? It's not real. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. Maybe they had a bad day and they want to take you out on you. I don't, I don't get it. But it's, no. it's, 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 it's weird day. though. Like every day, some people have bad lives. So <laughs> damn. But like, yeah, even with the storm video that I post, like people are still arguing with me. It's like, actually, she's Egyptian. I'm like, no, she's not Egyptian. Like she. And then, and you will explain yourself completely in one comment. And instead of reading that comment, they'll just comment the same thing that somebody else heard the comment. Under yeah. it. Yeah. Oh, like, please. <laughs> I'm not going to explain myself again. Yeah. But yeah, for uh, context, for those of you that don't follow me on TikTok, if you're not following me on TikTok, what are you doing? Follow me on TikTok. Follow Frankie on TikTok. Okay. Ron, as soon as he starts posting content. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I do, I do I, have I, a question uh, that someone put in there. Um, so the scene where Harold finesses the gods Mm-hmm. Um, I thought it was dumb because I'm like, they don't even know this dude, and he just roll in both. Yeah, I was like, can't they? he came in from the place they said, right? He yeah. they called him from the grave. Mm-hmm. He had the what's this called in his pocket, and they were like, nah, F Conchu. And so they made Conchu look me, crazy. They 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 gaslighted Conchu. Right, but Mark, someone yeah. was saying that maybe it's that he's working, he's been working with them. I mean, that would make sense because like- That would make more sense. Y- y'all are gods. Like, I feel like y'all should have did a little bit more investigation because it did feel like a he said, she said, like- Yeah. But like, even if we don't really mess with you, 
I know, like, I know you to a millennium, and I'm gonna, like, this Kevin Bacon lookalike pull up on me. <laughs> but they also, I guess they also didn't like Khonshu for a millennium, so. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. I know, and, but Like, Khonshu said it wasn't his first time in prison. You know, even still, they're they're believing a human over a God and the precedent that that starts. You get and what you know I'm saying? How, and you know how you in that I, like just I want this person to just give me one reason. I want to punch him in his give, give me one reason to punch him in his Yo, jaw. Exactly, exactly. Even they if they were looking a, for it, they were looking for even it. Even if there was a creator we didn't really like, right? Pulled up and he was talking wild, and we we're like, we don't like him. But a white person came in that we didn't know. And was like, he's a liar. Yeah, but all the Ooh. most of the other guys were white too. So like, you, they probably like, yeah, that's no. Brother, I'm that's I'm giving right you context. Yeah, yeah, no, I know, I yeah, I know, yeah, I know, yeah, I know, I know, yeah, I know, I know what you're saying. I know what you're saying. <laughs> so this is the white man coming to us talking about our brother, and it's like it's a rock and a hard place. But we gonna deal with that in house and tell that white boy to dip. No. Yeah, no, I get what you're saying though. You know, it, it, it was it was too easy. It was too easy. And he went back to doing what they asked him exactly, he exactly. was doing. Yeah. He went right back to it. I was like, oh, this is insane. But uh, we're not going to be that much longer because I just got to, because I don't have the upgraded version of Zoom. Mm -hmm. I can only do for, yeah, I can only do for an hour. Oh, you got to so pay just, for that. Yeah, I got to pay. It was like, <laughs> so it was like, I got, so I got like five minutes and 21 minutes, seconds left. So, but let me, so let me ask y'all, like out of all the three episodes though, like what, what do you like? Do you have a favorite, or like, what do you think is the best? It's one sad the that we're saying this one is could have been better, but it might be my favorite still because I I just wait, I was waiting for the action. We got to see uh, Layla pop off too. Um, the action was good. I mean, we learned a lot more. They introduced the other characters. Um, I just wish the series was longer. Like you said, the six episode format is like, it's, it, yeah. you know, it's gonna be done soon. I agree. I think this episode is the best like standalone episode. But like to me, one and two felt like one episode, in which case I like that better. Does that make sense? Yeah, no, they should have released episodes one and two together as opposed to separate. It just felt like one long story and it was good. Like I, when I watched it back to back, I was like, oh yeah, this is a lot better. Um, yeah, I think, I think three is the best of it. At this point in the series, three episodes in, do you think like, What's your ranking in terms of like, obviously we've seen the whole series of other shows, but like just take the first three episodes of all the other shows. Where would this rank? It's, it's hard them. because some shows had more than six episodes. And I think a lot of the shows didn't only, pop don't, until the only one that have don't either. only WandaVision had more than six episodes. That, well, yeah. and, and what if, but that's different because yeah, yeah. every episode is standalone. Yeah, but all of them are like six, seven episodes. I, yeah, I think I all of them start hitting at episode three as well. So no, Loki off rip. I was yeah, Loki was first two episodes. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Falcon Loki. and the Winter Soldier, Hawkeye, all second, off. Yeah, rip. Falcon and Winter Soldier, second episode. From so I, I put this at the bottom. Oh yeah. I mean, what do you think is 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 it what, what show? Is it what is it better than? Is what yeah, you're I, I can't, I can't immediately say that. So I, I mean, yeah. I would say I would. I would say what this is higher than maybe what if, because only like three yeah, episodes. Yeah, only a couple of what, what if episodes yeah. with bank. I guess. They were all stand, each episode of those were like legitimately standalone it's, until the end. You know what I mean? Agreed. It's an anthology series. I, I mean, it's like a, and when I say it's the worst, it's like saying Cars is the worst Pixar movie. It it doesn't make <laughs> Cars bad, right? It's just yeah. that everything else is so good that this is mid. Yeah, no, I, I agree with that. Like, it's not like I don't like I'm enjoying Moon Knight, but it's yeah. not like I'm hyped for the, you know, every, you know. Yeah. Yeah. I'd be like, oh, shit, it's Wednesday. Let me watch Moon Knight. It's not like I'll be, I'm going to stay up and wait to watch it. You know, Yeah, even, I'd even, be like, oh, shit, it's. Wednesday. Yes, Wednesday. Wednesday. Yeah. yeah, even knowing what I know about the four episodes, like it's just like, all right, whatever. <laughs> yeah. And by episode, the end of episode four is when the real heat should be there, right? If they have just two more episodes to wrap it up, then we should be at the climax mm -hmm. by episode four. Yeah, you should be. But I was just like, yeah. Yeah. I, I, <laughs> I mean, by the end of episode four, I was just like, what the hell is this? But it wasn't like, oh, shit. Yeah, they blew it was just like, yeah. yeah, it was just like, what, what is this? I don't know. But anyway, I'm at now we down at the two minute mark. So any final thoughts? I mean, like Frankie said, it's good. It's not saying it's the, the worst. It's not saying that it's bad. It's just not as good as the other ones. The other ones have been great, you know. 
if you got like all A's and you get one B plus, you know, that's not a bad grade. It's just not an A. Right. Yeah, but you know, there's no nuance on internet. They could be like, "Y'all hate Moon Knight." Yeah, <laughs> yeah exactly. Yeah. Oh, Moon Knight is trash. Yeah, they're saying Moon Knight is trash. Mm-hmm. Like, no, that's not what we're saying. <laughs> mm-hmm. So, yeah, Frankie, final thoughts. Uh, yeah, I thought it was mid. Yeah, I mean, we mid. we all a, li- a little better than fine. In the words of Amanda, <laughs> <laughs> Amanda <laughs> reviving. She'd be like, it's less than fine or better than fine. Yes. But, but Oscar Isaac is still fine. <laughs> Absolutely. He's more than fine. Not enough. He, he, he's not doing enough shirtless scenes or whatever. And this like that, right. that'll, 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 that'll put it up to like 20 Frankie flames for me. Facts, <laughs> facts, facts. I do like that he totally changed. I think he's one of the best actors in the series right now. Yeah, no, every that time he goes, every time he goes from Mark to uh to to I was about to say Jacob. Who the fuck is Jacob? Mark to Steven, like you could tell, like you could it's see the transition. Yeah. yeah, like I we were watching, you know, something else, and I was just like, Yeah, like he looked like I asked Mike, like, did his hair change or something? Like something's like completely different about him. Like so I'm, yeah, I'm definitely yeah. curious to see how he yeah. does the third personality. But anyway, now we're down to less than one minute. So we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna end the stream. Thank you guys for watching. Hit the like button and everything like that. Let me know your thoughts of Moon Knight. Three episodes. Where does this rank in terms of your favorite of the show so far at this point? And any predictions that you might have. But with that, yeah, we about to be out. And yeah, follow us all. Link, in the, link in the description. Take care. Peace. Once.